All right, Coach. Um, uh, pretty convincing second half for you guys, and you're able to move on. Just your thoughts? thought we executed better in the third quarter. In the second quarter, really got the lead extended out to about 20, 23 there. Felt really good about it. We worked on a brand new offense in our fourth quarter, and we didn't do very well there. So we got some things to fix on that. But, you know, that's the first time they've ran it in a live game situation. So there's some anxiety there a little bit, some things that don't quite go perfect there on that. Overall, thought we executed extremely well. We scored the ball well. I thought our defense was really good the second quarter. Uh, we went to that man-to-man -man for a while, and that really stymied them for a little bit. Our intensity was good. Felt like we got in passing lanes really well, and we dictated the pace. Everybody knows what Dawson Frost is capable of, but how about Jason Frost tonight? He didn't play like a freshman, did he? No, he doesn't, and that's the thing about him. I love him coming off the bench for us. He does, he kind of gets the nerves taken out of starting a little bit, and then when he comes on the floor, he's ready to go, and I like that. He hits some shots. He hit those back-to-back -back threes in that left corner there over there, and that was huge for us. Gave us the lead uh, kind of back to maybe 10-15, and then we were able to take off from there. He, he's our catalyst. Probably hard to take away any negatives from tonight, but is there anything that you go away from this wanting to maybe improve on going into next week? It's going to be our execution when the we got a loud gymnasium, and when I can't yell out an offense, we have to be able to pull the ball back, see what they're in, if they've made a change, and be able to execute that. You know, they went man to man for about four minutes. I don't think we knew. I don't think we had a clue until I finally got after a little bit and yelled over there. So. Uh, on Thursday night, we're not going to be able to do that. This gym's going to be packed at Red Oak. It's going to be a loud place. It's Bedford Mount Air. It's going to be a huge game there. Uh, obviously, you know that's going to be a major gym, so they're not going to be able to just uh, yell out things. We're going to have to be able to move. Before we dive into that Bedford matchup, you told me earlier in the year you guys were hoping to get to that district final. Um, you hadn't been able to get there in years past. You do get there, so you feel like maybe you've got over a little bit of a hump? I, we did, absolutely. The goal was here. I mean, we wanted to get back to here. Now, we wanted to win a district championship, so we're close to the goal. We got one more to get, and that's a big one for us. Bedford will be well coached. Frank's going to be ready. You know, his team's going to be ready. Brennan's fantastic. Jordan Perkins is great. Uh, Cooper Nally is a freak of an athlete in the middle there. They're going to be really good. The guy that's been most impressive right now is that fourth guy. He's been doing really good. Lucas has been good for him, and I think that's going to be our trick is try to handle those four or five with Cummings not being able to drive the lane. Got to keep them guys out of the lane a little bit better than what we did the last time over here uh, but yeah they'll be ready we will be too be the third time you guys have met you won the first two but how terrifying of a team are they to play a third time Oh, they are, absolutely. Uh, the good news is these guys have been playing since seventh grade. I mean, it's Cooper and Brennan and Jordan with our seniors. These guys have been going since junior high. This isn't the third time we played them. This is about the 40th time we played them. So, um, yeah, we've had games we've lost. We've had games we've won. We need to execute really well, especially early, try to get them in foul trouble if we can in certain spots, see if we can't get some lucky plays to go our way early and then take that lead if we can again. Hey, 